The creative power that shapes our universe, our planet and its boundless expressions of life is magnificent. Every genesis follows an intrinsic mathematical order. Underlying all this are the same laws of nature. Unraveling these regularities has always been one of the premier goals of science. At the Heidelberg Institute for Theoretical Studies, mathematicians and computer scientists try to capture the dynamics of big-scale processes in mathematical models. HITS strives at developing theories in all kinds of mathematical disciplines by using complex mathematical modeling and by developing tools for evaluating these models using modern computer and IT technology. Based on mathematical models, scientists develop computer programs that allow them to analyze large collections of experimental data. With the help of supercomputers, they create simulations of a complexity that in the past were unfeasible. How did our universe develop after the Big Bang 13 and a half billion years ago? Volker Springel's research group, Theoretical Astrophysics, wrote a computer code to generate the most detailed simulation of the formation of our universe. Executed on powerful high-performance computers, it still took three months and 8,000 parallel processors to calculate the simulation. The Illustrious Simulation is a very large calculation of the evolution of the universe used to track how galaxies form. Amazingly, we see in the simulation now galaxies just like we see in the real observations through real telescopes. But in real observations, we can only look at the universe at one instant in time. In the simulations, we can track the fate of galaxies forward in time and also look into their past. Weather forecasts are based on complex mathematical models. Tillman Gneiting's research group, Computational Statistics, deals with the mathematical foundations of forecasting, focusing on probabilistic weather prediction. We are interested in probabilistic forecasts. We used to say, it's going to rain tomorrow, it will rain tomorrow. Nowadays we say how likely it is to rain tomorrow. For instance, we state an 80% chance of rain for tomorrow. A probabilistic forecast gets closer to the truth because it takes model uncertainties and uncertainties of initial data into account. An ensemble forecast runs each day's weather prediction up to 50 times with modified initial values. In statistical post-processing, researchers correct for systematic forecast deficiencies in order to improve the quality of the predictions. Many weather services rely on these methods. Quality of data is also a topic of Vincent Evelyn's research group, Data Mining and Uncertainty Quantification. The scientists are investigating the impact of uncertainties in various technical systems. Medical devices, such as surgical instruments, are an application they especially focus on. How risky is an operation for a specific patient? Uncertainties in the individual health conditions and in the technical devices make it difficult to evaluate the risk of an operation. The researchers develop numerical methods that allow a surgeon to simulate an operation in advance by taking the personal risk factors of the patient into account. Assuming a complex surgery, consider an aorta simulation, for example, Uncertainty quantification is a revolution in numerical simulation for medical engineering for two reasons. One, based on the risk evaluation of the operation, and the second one is related to the fact that we can consider patient-specific information. Besides the many applied areas that we are doing research in, we also need to build the basis for or those applied methods for those applied techniques and this is basic research in whatever area you can look at and in particular it requires basic research in mathematics which we try to support strongly. The transformation of geometrical structures follows complex rules. Uncovering such mathematical structures is what Professor Anna Wienhard is interested in. Her research group explores uncharted territories in the field of differential geometry. 
Their basic mathematical research investigates how geometrical structures deform without losing their internal symmetry. She is professor of mathematics at the University of Heidelberg and cooperates with the researchers at HITS. For me, mathematics and mathematical research is a very creative process, even sometimes intuitional process. So it's discovering new structures, building new structures, and if you like, it's really like discovering new worlds. Exchanging ideas with scientists from adjoining fields of research is an integral part of the concept of HITS. What fascinates me about the HITS is that it creates an atmosphere where researchers and scientists from very different areas and very different fields interact in a very natural way. And this way you discover points of contact you didn't know exist before and you really develop innovative research together. With its interdisciplinarity, the Heidelberg Institute for Theoretical Studies is an inspiring place for innovative ideas to evolve.